Well, I remember my I was working in uh, Atlanta, mm-hmm. and those guys, there's a bunch of goombas owned the place. Really, a lot of fun, but too much coke, right? I, mean, I don't do it again. anyway. It's like they were all well, coke. Eight o'clock in the morning, they're still dressed from the night before. And David Spade, they tried to get me a spot, and he was. And I like David. I always said he was talented, but I know he's he's not like aggressive, right? And uh, they said, "What about this kid?" And I said, "Hire him. There's something special about him. Not like I'm a big talent agent, but you know, I think I think, I think it was, I was right. I mean, he, he ended up doing like four four series that were hits, all kinds mm-hmm. of movies. You know, but they they thought because he was a kind of mellow that it wasn't funny, but it, it, was, it was very good. Well, excellent. I'm, I'm a, I just suffered talent from hags like you out there. <laughs> <laughs> I never really watched much of his much of his stand up. I think by the time, uh, like you know, I was really watching stuff. He was probably in, more into movies at that point. Does he still do stand up regularly? Yeah, yeah. But the the thing when he did with Fish, Chris Farley, that was he, he, they were brilliant together. Yeah, yeah. Tom, Tommy mm-hmm. Boy, Black Sheep. Those are all classics. Yo, Dom, over here. Hey, hey Dom. Hey. Uh... Yo, Dom. 